Your flick duck. Uh, can I get back to you on that? What, what's going on? You were all growling and scary before. Come on and join us, Flick. What was all the fuss about? Let me get this straight. This lip-smacking duck-eating bear who was chasing me is not a lip-smacking duck-eating bear? I guess I did growl a little, but that was because I stumped my big toe. Someone left a big tin of cheese and crackers right in the middle of the yard. But I still don't get it. Why were you coming over in the first place? Well, I kept hearing someone calling my name. Bear! Bear! Oh, yeah. That was me. Well, let her get going. Thanks for the s'mores and whatnot. You never told us what brings you to Lake Hoo-Ha, Mr. Bear. Family and me are on vacation. Got the RV park just up the hill. cried bear all those times. Mm, I thought it would be funny. It wasn't funny, Flick. I don't think you learned a lesson from our bedtime story tonight. If you keep lying to everybody, then they won't believe you when you need them to. Sorry, everybody. And don't forget, you bothered that nice bear for no reason. All right, already. I've learned my lesson. Well, I guess that wraps things up. Not so fast, Flick. You're coming home. But what about our front yard? Cherry pie for a week. Uh, how about Boston cream? Boston cream, maybe. But definitely no cherry. Wow, what a night. Anybody sleepy? No. Nope. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Good. John Jacob Jingle Otter Breath. His name.